Hey everybody, Uncle Carl here. Uh, welcome back to Twin Moons Tavern, Quarantine Kitchen, day 21, three weeks. If you're new here, this is not how I typically do stuff. Just like everyone else, we're adapting to the quarantine issues. These videos are just very roughly done and low production value just so I can pump them up pretty quickly. Before I go any further, I'd like to give a quick shout out to Rebecca and anyone else who is in isolation because they are either waiting for test results or they've received positive test results. Hang in there, we're all rooting for you. Just keep on, don't give up on us. All that being said, I've seen a variation of this particular video popping up a lot. No one has, I haven't seen anybody call it anything specific, but it's basically making a sandwich, an egg sandwich inside a pan with everything all at the same time. Um, I'm gonna do my own version of it, which is not reinventing the wheel, but it seems like a fun thing to do. And uh, I'm gonna give it a shot, so here we go. So first we got our pan, uh, something non-stick, or at least semi-non-stick. I'm using a cast iron that's pretty well seasoned, so I shouldn't have too much of a problem with it. On a medium, medium low heat, a little bit of olive oil, and I got three beaten eggs. Just gonna pour right in there. A little bit of salt. Let those eggs spread around. Then I got one piece of bread. Get it soaked up a little bit and flip it over. And then a second piece of bread, soaked up a little bit, and then flip it over. And then we're just gonna let this cook and let the egg set. And now that the egg is pretty much set, a little bit of rawness still on the top, but that's okay. I'm gonna loosen it up a little bit, make sure it's not sticking. And now we're gonna flip it this way as opposed to this way. Because I think if you flip it this way, it's much more likely to fold in half. So just kind of squeeze it underneath there. This might take a little practice, but one, two, and three. Boom, there you go. And now you're just going to put your fillings right up in here. I'm going to use some cheese, some bacon that I already cooked. Try to make sure you don't have too much along this seal because my nutritionist watches. I'm gonna put a little bit of spinach in here and the key to this is gonna be not to overfill it, which I might have done. Fold in the sides. Yeah, I overfilled it. So this is gonna be a little difficult. And then from here, I'm gonna go ahead and fold it in half. Give it like a minute on either side just to get that cheese melty. Carefully flip it. And just take it on out. And time to dig in. Here we go, it's a sandwich. Like I said, it's a little overstuffed. But let's see what it looks like on the inside. Oh yeah. That looks delicious. It's French toast and an omelet all wrapped in one. Mmm, that's delicious. Really simple idea, creative idea. It's a good way to change things up if you're getting bored with stuff the way it is. So you should definitely try it and um, yeah, it's really good. All that being said, wash your hands, keep those social distances. Please don't go outside unless you absolutely have to and be kind to each other. It's gonna be very emotionally demanding on each on everybody. So just kind of be thoughtful and kind to each other. So we'll catch you here next time. Until then, peace.